Okay, whoa, I'm actually pretty jealous here. I wanna have some superpowers. If you guys could just have one superpower, what would it be? Let me know in the comment section below. And thanks to CCTV and security cameras, we have captured people doing some pretty strange and phenomenal things. I think we might need to call Noah Bennett from Heroes because we just might have some real life superheroes here on Earth. With that said, let's fly right into this list. This is the top 10 people with superpowers caught on tape. Starting us off, in at number 10, we have the real life Hulk, minus the huge muscles and you know, the obvious green skin. A security camera camera captured two people approaching a man who is physically abusing his girlfriend. At first the two strangers was yelling at him to stop, but once the guy confronted him, a full brawl happened. And I think one of these guys just went super saiyan, or he's just freakishly strong. I'll let you guys be the judge, watch this. Okay, did you guys see how much air and distance he actually got? I bet he's a beast of the gym, or he's Batman. The flash recorded on CCTV footage rushes into number nine, but don't blink because you might miss him. This, my friend, is why you always look both ways before crossing the street. Because I don't know about you guys, but there isn't a super fast man lurking in my neighborhood. The comment for this video is blowing up with people triggered. Some people are arguing that this is totally fake and is super edited, while others swear that something like this has happened to them in real life. I don't know what side I'm on, but all I know is anything is possible, so why not? So are you team Barry Allen or are you team editing? Next up, number eight, we have some good old fashioned telekinesis. Now that's, uh, that's pretty impressive, but I think he's going to have a rude awakening when he goes back to Hogwarts. He should know better than to perform magic in the muggle world. Even if this whole thing was fake, I still really enjoyed watching it. I mean, my superpower would be putting food in my mouth and making it disappear. Okay, let's move on. Oh, what the heck just happened? I think I got some superpowers. I think I just teleported. All right, we're at number seven right now. I'm, I'm, I'm pretty sure. I'm a little, I'm a little disoriented. That was kind of cool. So in this next clip, you're about to see a biker saved by a teleporting person. Okay, let's take a look at that again because it was a little bit fast. Let's, let's put it into slow motion. Is this real life right now? No, seriously, is this real? There are actually a lot of reports of people seeing others teleporting, and I'm really hoping this is real because I would never have to be stuck in traffic ever again. And now at number six, we're talking about mind control. Now this is a very powerful ability to have. If I had mind control, we would be the most subscribed channel on YouTube for sure, and I would never have to pay for anything ever again. Maybe it's a good thing, you know, we don't have the ability to control people's minds. What would you guys do if you can control people's minds? But let's take a look at a girl who needs to attend the Xavier Institute for Higher Learning because she definitely needs to get her powers under control. If we're not careful, we might have another Carrie White situation on our hands. From teleportation to some superhuman strength in at number five. I've always believed that we don't really have an idea how strong we are until we're in an extreme difficult situation. Take this next clip for example. Two men rush over to a helicopter that has just crash landed into a river. Once they make it to the crash site, they notice that their friend was trapped underneath the helicopter underwater. They tried freeing the man, but ultimately the helicopter had to be moved. So the guy took a deep breath and attempted to lift this heavy machine off of his friend who was drowning. Tiny then reached down, lifted up the rotors, and did kind of a, a sumo wrestler sound. Lifted the helicopter with his bare hands. Tiny said, You got his foot. 
and Henry said, yeah. I said, this is honestly so incredible, and this guy is truly a hero. Let's just say that these guys are gonna be friends for the rest of their lives. Telekinesis brings us to number four. I remember I wanted to be like Matilda when I was a kid. I mean, she has some freaking awesome powers. I thought it was cool that she was able to control objects with their minds and get revenge on Miss Trunchbull. But this person is the real deal. She used her telekinesis to stop a moving shopping cart from hitting a kid. Roll the clip. Maybe this is Matilda. Is she all grown up? I don't know about you guys, but if I had telekinesis, I would use this to bring me a nice cold Coke from the fridge and maybe a piece of cake. Maybe, you know, shh, grab the TV remote. Okay, maybe, maybe not. I don't know. Is, is that a dumb, is that a waste of powers? Is that, is that a waste of telekinesis? Racing into number three, we have another man with super fast speed. Okay, whoa, did I just see that? A man walking to his car in a parking garage got a lot more than he bargained for. As he was opening his truck, he felt something zoomed by him, and when he turned around, all of the car alarms was going off in a row. I don't know where that guy had to go in such a hurry. Maybe his mother yelled, dinner is ready, and then he started like, Phew. Are you guys ready to see this next superpower? Well, in at number two, we have intangibility. What the heck is this? Well, I know it sounds like a mouthful, but basically, people with this power can move through solid objects, like Patrick Swayze did in the movie Ghost. Such a good movie. But unlike Patrick Swayze, this guy kind of takes a tumble. So in this next clip, you'll see a man fall out of a moving van even though the doors are closed. You guys must watch this. Okay, ouch, I mean, that's gotta really hurt. This guy needs to get his powers under control because falling through objects would be hella annoying. A man flying brings us to number one. Is it a bird? Is it a plane? No, it's just, it's a Superman imposter. This flying humanoid was spotted hovering over the Q-tub miner located in Delhi, India. Judging by the amount of people screaming, I feel like a lot of people who were there believe that this is real. And who knows, maybe some people can fly and save thousands of dollars on air tickets. Those things are just so expensive and the seats are just so tiny, so why not? Up, up, and away. But you know what? I'm gonna have to ring the BS alarm, like really ring it, because this, this whole thing, it's just, it just can't be real. It's gotta be BS. Is human flying possible? Or or is Michael Jordan the only human who can actually fly? Well, there you guys have it. You've all made it to the end of this video. Thank you guys so much, and I'll see you guys all in the next Most Amazing Top 10 video.